Meteorologist Megan Dennehy, sunny and a little bit warmer coming up. Just a little bit warmer yeah. today. We're still <laughs> going to be below normal, but you know, when you see that bright orb in the sky, it's a little better than the pesky cloud cover we had to deal with yesterday. The U.S. representative passed away early this morning at age 68. Cummings was what many called a civil rights trailblazer and one of the most prominent African Americans in Congress. He was also the chairman of the White House Oversight and Reform Committee. Right now, it's leading the impeachment inquiry into the president. Nicole Killian reports on his legacy from Baltimore. And News 4 is watching out for you on the road. Right now, a portion of Interstate 64 is closed. Modoc closed the left lane and also the left shoulder between Kings Highway and Hampton. It's because of a washed out roadway on the westbound side. Powerhouse Sky Zoom 4 flew over the area around the Science Center yesterday. After crews find out exactly what caused the washout, they will repair that area. This is News 4 watching out for you. Welcome back to News 4 at noon. I'm Justin Andrews in for Claire Kelly. Just into the newsroom, some of the details of the deal to end a month long strike at GM. The four year contract would include pay raises, lump sum payments and an $11,000 signing bonus. Tens of thousands of GM workers remain on the picket lines today, including some at the Winsville plant. There. I know, right? A little bit above it. <laughs> so what's the weather amazing. looking like? We're moving to the weekend. We are. We've got some good sunshine. Well, we love sunshine, right? It's always good. It just makes <laughs> you feel good, even if it is a little bit cool out there. We have a warming trend. Okay. So just in time for Friday, 70s. Ooh. That's good. I like that. I'll take I it. I do have some showers in the 60s. All right. Thanks so much, Megan. We've got some breaking news we're following right now out of North St. Louis. Officers were called to a report of a crash at West Florissant at Interstate 70. This is a live look from the scene on the ground right here. Once they arrived, they discovered one man was shot. He was taken to the hospital. We're working to learn the man's condition. This is a developing story right now. We will bring you the latest as we get it. Looks like we have powerhouse Sky Zoom 4 flying above us here. This is a live look. Again, we'll be right back after the break following this breaking news. Wild. That's crazy. But I mean, it's social media, so there you go. All right, thanks for joining us for News 4 at noon. We'll see you back here on News 4 at 4. <laughs>